Hi there, welcome to another video of mine, slightly different today. You'll see there is a uh, part of a mini album there um, that I have made. Uh, those are some camera chipboards from October afternoon that was a mini album set. I've painted one side white with a sheen on and the other side gold. And I'm just going to show you how I made the little confetti piece for the middle. Um, my blog was uh, below there at the beginning, decisioninspired.com. Please do check that out to see the more in-depth photos of the mini album itself. Um, and this is just going to show uh, just this confetti part here. So you'll see I've, I've drawn around the circle there and cutting out two parts of vellum. Um, just pop those in there um, and I'm just debating about how I'm going to sew around the edges whether I'm going to do it by hand or with my machine um, you see here I'm just kind of thinking about that and it's probably better if I sew around it now and then leave a gap to put the sequins in that was what I was thinking so this is my sequin jar you can see it's all mixed together um, not always the best idea but hey um, storage works a little bit better for me that way um, so you'll see here I've just sewn around the edge in gold on my machine and I'm just going to put some of the sequins in, um, in, in here now. Just having a little bit of trouble. I kind of wish I'd left a slightly larger gap. Um, so you can see just kind of independently putting in the colours that I like. I've got some little um, wooden veneer pieces as well. Um, these came in a Studio Calico kit. I think they might be freckled fawn. Um, just pop those in, kind of make it a little bit more interesting. And then I'm just finding some more different coloured sequins. These ones came, I think, in the Project Life Studio Calico Marks & Co kit, uh, which is a really wonderful kit. And I'm just using them all in here. Um, I love getting the sequins in those kits. And it's nice to use them a little bit differently sometimes. Um, so popped all of that in and then I basically stitched up the end and that's pretty much it for me today You're gonna see here's a photo of the finished album. Please do check out my blog for the full uh, finished item. Thank you